Hello, Libra. Welcome and welcome back. We are doing a reading for you and the energy surrounding you here in the next several weeks. So keep in mind, Libra, that this may not resonate with each and every Libra, but feel free to check previous on future rays or your other placement readings for more or different information. By the way, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node today. I was sitting here and it was between Leo, Aries, and Libra. Maybe you're dealing with these signs here or you have placements. And I was shuffling the deck and yours was sitting on top. Your indicator, the justice card here, was sitting on top. And I was like, well, I guess it's Libra today. All right, so let's do, <laughs> let's move into it, Libra, okay? I feel like you're going to be getting confirmation here. If you've asked um, a question to the universe, to God, you're, to source, you're going to be receiving an immediate answer, okay? So something is going to be very clear to you. You're going to get confirmation. I'm also getting that you could be psychic. Your intuition is quite up, okay? It's, it's up, it's ticking up there, all right? So let's see what's going on with Libra, please. Yeah, I feel like your intuition is strong right now. I'm getting the word hazy. So before, maybe you were confused, okay? Now you're gonna know the answer. What's on the bottom of the deck? It's about love, okay? Okay, we have religion coming in. I very much see that you are abiding by the rules here. Abiding by your feelings and a relationship. There's someone of importance coming into your reading and you view this as important and the way that you're showing your love or the way that you show that you care about someone, whether this is romantic or not, you show that you care by doing what they like, okay? Or doing something that you know they will appreciate and also by following the rules of your relationship or I'm hearing ground rules, groundbreaking, okay? So it does look like you could be showing your affection to somebody here in the coming time. Very strongly though, like you have something to show them, something to make them feel happy. I see, because someone is in a fragile way right now. Okay, that's what this is. Let's get one more on this person here. That D will come. Okay, that's what this is. Okay. You could be having something coming in that's trying and testing your situation, your relationship here. And it looks to be about a trust thing coming in, okay? This person over here may not be very trusting of you or this is you toward them, okay? But there's something about trust that's coming in where I don't know if I believe in this now, okay? I don't know if I can believe in you, in your abilities, psychic abilities even i'm not sure that you're being honest okay i'm not sure that you are who you say you are that's what's coming in and this person is on kind of like a shaky ground here the ground is crumbling beneath okay because someone cannot stand firmly in their beliefs and it's this person they don't know what to think what to believe here about either you the situation all right we do have a new beginning that is very appropriate it is coming in but this hasn't been chosen yet this person hasn't gone with i'm hearing the candidate wow they haven't been firm in any which way as we're speaking. So let me see this, um, Libra. Let me show, show me Libra here. Whoa, 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 that's a lot. Yeah, see? So you have this jealousy energy coming in, okay? You're burnt out. Someone is just like, I feel like you're over something, the way that, the way that someone behaves. 411 there. What's on the bottom? Someone could be accusing you of something you didn't do here, Libra. They're like, oh, well, you went around town and you said this, or you told my friends that, my friends know this about you, or I know this about you. No, I didn't, okay? So I feel like you're going to be dealing with someone in this coming time that this person like could be telling you you're doing all kinds of things, or like you're getting caught up in a web of lies. This isn't true. Whatever this person is saying is not true. Yeah, but the thing is it doesn't, it's like I'm over here doing what I need to do, okay? And you're aware of this, like you're aware that you're doing what you need to do here. And 
that's all that matters at this point. Because if you were trying to plead your case or if you were trying to stand up for yourself, now you're not anymore. You're like, I'm over it, okay? If you don't believe me, that's on you. If you don't believe me, you're the one who's feeling hurt by that and I don't know what to say at this point, okay? So there's definitely something coming in. You're not gonna be feeling like you owe anything here at this point. It's like, I don't owe you to feel bad about your perceived whatever, okay? It's like a perception that this person may have, okay? You're just over it. So you're gonna be making some changes. There's someone else that this person is dragging into this situation as well. Um, you're just over it. You're sick and tired of the sick and tired stuff. All right, one sec. This is all popping out. Wow, Libra. So I feel like you have a lot to say to this person, but you just bite your tongue. You're just like, it's not even worth it. It's not even worth explaining or expressing this to this person at this point because they're just inconsolable or they're just whatever. Let me see here. Libra, please. Libra vibe. Yeah, so you're the Knight of Pentacles. You're looking at them like, what are you talking about? Okay. Let me see. Okay, Hermit. Wow. The thing is, you already know everything that you need to know about this individual at this point, okay? You could be dealing with a Virgo or there's some Virgo energy here. Yeah. You're regretting giving this person any type of attention at all right now, okay? Like you feel like this person is just meddling or that there's someone here that's just stirring the pot for no reason, but yet they still want to be around you, yet they still want to talk to you, they still want to offer you something, or they're still curious about you some way, okay? All right, let's 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 see what's going on with this individual. Well, the two of pentacles. So it's like they're putting on like a public display here. There could be like many moving parts that this person's bringing into this, like whether this is other people or what, like this is somebody who goes around and tells everyone something and everybody's like, whoa, look at that person, you know? That's what this is. They're out here like maybe talking about you, telling people about you or other people, I don't know, man. I don't know if it's family or what that is. There's people, like an audience. Hey, this person has an audience and you're looking at them like what a shame okay what a shame that you're you know orchestrating this whole thing here okay it's like they're trying to get both sides to believe there's two sides here but but they want theirs believed okay all right so the nine of pentacles yeah you have quite a bit of maybe you have a virgo placement all right um Maybe you do, all right. I feel like this person was going off some type of information. They themselves don't even know where it came from. Or it's like, you dug some stuff up at it. Like, what is this? Gossip, maybe. It's something like that. And yeah, the back of the hangman. So here's Libra here coming in with that justice. The thing is the truth speaks for itself, okay? If somebody was lying or pulling strings over here, it does feel like it's about you. Um, it's not It's not going to, it's like they're, they're hurting themselves in this process, okay? Whatever they're saying about you or shooting towards you here with that eight of wands, it doesn't get through, it actually, it hits them right back. So if somebody's spreading rumors about you, it's coming back to bite them here. It's coming back to hurt them, right? Now, the thing is, it, even if it's true or it, who cares? That's what it is. Like, no one even cares if it's true or not. Whatever this person is saying or doing, no one cares. But there's definitely deception involved. The truth speaks for itself. Libra speaks for themselves here, all right? Yeah, okay. It's like someone had some group of people or like a dynamic going on where they felt like they could say certain things. Some of you guys, this is someone who like dabbles in, in like magical stuff here, all right? I'm telling you. It's just like, it's 
the more that I look at that, the more it gets more intense about that. Okay, so let's see. Show me Libra with this vibe here. Ace of Pentacles. Well, well, Emperor. The thing is, yeah, no. Stick with your plan, okay? I see that you are anyway. There's something about you receiving a really good offer, okay? Like things are going well for you. Your stature is good. Some of you guys are being offered a new position, okay? A new job or you're working on, on something new, like a new project. And it's helping you to have progress. Like a lot of progress is coming in, especially with your stability here. You're unshakable regarding this person is what I'm seeing. So you have the stable foundation, you're firm. Nothing's gonna shake you here. Let me see this person. Yeah. It's like they're out here feeding lies, okay? Something about this person, are, are they like obsessed with you? I feel like you're starting to feel this person just always wants to be part of your life or part of your world, okay? You're over here like, I don't even know you that well. Like, who are you? Or like, um, you don't know me, why are you talking, okay? This is like a Jekyll and Hyde energy right here. Some of you guys, this is an earth sign, could be a Capricorn, or this is involving um, finances, work, your place of work, okay, place of employment, whatever this is. And someone's out here like spreading some type of silliness all right let's just call it like that i feel like everybody sees that as silly you're not being dragged into it so whatever this person is saying or doing you might have a fake friend around you okay like this person just wants to be around you or this person just wants to be close to you this person wants to be a part of your life when you're just like i don't get it like what's the point yeah you have like a fake friend for a fake romantic part i don't know they're out here like spreading stuff okay Ooh, that sounds like someone could be having a uh, an illness of some type of, yeah, down there probably. Let's see here. Like they're spreading things, okay? Through contact, physical contact. Wow. Okay, so temperance, all right, here's the thing, okay? Whatever the heck is going on here, you are protected first and foremost. I am seeing that very strongly. You also have a lot of perseverance and you're not giving up, you're not letting down. There's something about you that's actually strengthening instead, okay? You're not getting weakened, like you're not um, feeling lousy, you're not feeling bad. You're even tempered and even willed here, okay? And you standing up there when it gets difficult or you hanging on is actually working to your benefit. So you you coming in like all, I got this, okay? You Like you got this is working to your benefit. It's like you're, you're realizing it's no point to be worried, no point to be paranoid. You could be dealing with someone who's a little bit paranoid about something. That's what it feels like. It's like, why is it like, is this person out of their mind or like why? Something weird is about them right now that you just can't place it. Don't worry about it. I don't see you worrying about it very much. Maybe you did at one point, but you're realizing it's not worth it. That's what this is. Let me see this person here. Yeah, you're not. See what I'm saying, all right? Some cancer energy as well. Nine of Cups and the Hermit. Mm. This person, it's like they keep trying to figure something out. This person keeps trying to figure out more stuff, more information to share. Like this is sharing, like someone wants to share. Could be a Virgo, all right, let me see this here. This is so interesting, okay? 
it looks like you've been living in your own bubble, okay? Like, you, like, I don't feel like you're very much associated with this person. Maybe at one point you were, and that's how they're seeing you even. Like, you're living in your own world. You're not really affected, or you weren't really affected by this. And now suddenly this person acts like they know you, you guys are best friends, or something strange is going on. They're seeing you as actually getting more stability in your life, getting all your wish fulfillments, okay? Like, you have a certain amount of stability in your life with the Nine of Pentacles like you're good you're good on your own you're looking forward to bigger and better things and they're coming your way this person is associating you with what they want so whether that means that they want you or they want to be you that's what this is because it's like oh libra has so many good things you know the king of wands here looking out into the future you have more good things coming to you so if it was good already it's going to even get better and they want it also they want you also they want to be you also they want whatever is associated with you that's what they associate with with success that's what they associate with confidence this is what they're associating with their goals and their aspirations here now some of you guys this is someone who wants you to talk to them be careful what you share with people during this time yeah some of you guys this is an earth sign person okay So this person's going to be investigating. I feel like, first of all, they've they've come across some information, whether it's they pulled it out their own behinds here or they actually came across some information about you. They're investigating that, okay? It's like, okay, am I right? Am I wrong? Or is there something I messed up on? Is this information correct? They're over here actually going back over things and they're feeling like you guys can have some sort of extension once they figure this out. It's like, should I apologize? Am I in the wrong here? So you definitely have this earth sign individual thinking about how many Maybe they messed up okay it's like maybe i was wrong okay so someone is thinking this well that's a good sign i guess all right so anyway they don't know what to believe guys that's what's going on but they're also the ones who are spreading it so i don't understand if you don't know what you believe why are you spreading it okay hmm you don't really want to be associated with this person anyway okay you feel like this person is never satisfied. Like this could be someone who is very nitpicky. Like let's say for example, oh man, here I go throwing a random example in here. Someone wants to order, you know, <laughs> some, some fries from McDonald's or something and also a soda, okay? And when they order it, they want their fries like the way it's normally made, but less salt, okay, and less greasy. And then they also want their soda with less ice, okay? For example, okay, like they need it a particular way. And when they get it how they ask for it, it's not good enough or it's still salty, it's still greasy, it's still, but you ordered from McDonald's, you know what I mean? But that's what that is. Like, how do you, how do you expect it to be some type of way? So that's kind of maybe some sort of a way that you perceive this individual, like nothing's ever good enough and you're always upset about something. You always have something to be mad about or like you have been upset about certain things that, you know, like you order something and you're not happy. Like, why did you order it? Why did you ask for that? That's kind of what it feels like. It, like. it feels like this person could be trying to apologize to you or trying to extend to you somehow and they didn't get what they wanted. So then they're out here acting like they're part of your story or something like that. I hope that makes sense. Or like they know something. This Capricorn person, this Earth sign, whoever. Capricorn, yeah. Virgo, something like that. Okay, so. Hmm. I feel like you might have uh, felt bad for a minute here. Okay, I'm also seeing something about slipping or slipped up. Okay, so if that's the case, everybody be careful with uh, spilling things or where you're walking. Okay, that's what I'm saying. But it does look like you felt bad at one point, but now you changed your mind, okay? It's like the diamond in the rough. Somehow this is working in your favor. Your intuition is guiding you. You know to be silent, you know to be quiet here, all right? You also have some defenses. Let me see. 
I'm hearing it speaks for itself. Okay, yeah, Libra speaks for themselves is what I'm hearing. I keep getting Libra speaks for itself or the truth speaks for itself here. And there we go. The four of wands. You guys could be, yeah, here it is. It's like you're being offered some sort of um, position or some sort of better opportunity or a relationship through this. Somehow this is turning into your favor here where they're like, oh, actually, like spirit guides are like, let's get Libra out of that situation and put him in a better one now, okay? Like after they endured all that or whatever this is, this relationship with this person, let's give Libra some peace, okay? That's what this looks like. You, It's like you were sad at first. Maybe you're sad to leave. You're sad with the changes that are happening. Then all of a sudden it's like a blessing. The 10 of pentacles. You're, you're having some sort of breakthrough here, okay? There's something surprising happening in your connections, in your relationships. You could run into someone that knows exactly what you need or knows exactly how to help you or it's like um it's almost like you you run into the ceo of a company or your company and they're like i like you libra let's let's you know let's move you on up over here it's something like that okay so spirit guy said enough is enough let me see this let me see this right here yeah some leo also let me see this right here There it is, the strength card again. <laughs> so this person is going to be having a realization, okay, that they caused a mess to the both of you with this five of cups. Both of you guys have this five of cups coming in. So there's going to be some regrets here. And this is them knowing that they need to manage whatever happened, what they did. Okay. They, they feel like they did that, but they would never admit that with that strength energy and this magician. Okay. So this is them. What else? seven of wands that's what i'm saying they're still going to defend their turf they're going to pretend like nothing happened this is like more leo energy is kicking in here like this person suddenly acting like they were in the right or um they're getting some pushback from the environment and even though they feel bad about what they did they're still you know holding steady they're like it's an unpopular opinion here by the way too it's like this person's defending themselves against the masses or against a group of people and they're not trying to like, they're bluffing, okay? They're not trying to let the truth be known or like they're not allowing it to be. Cause it's almost like, it's like reporters and like cameras flashing. What is it that you said? Okay, let's record this. Let's um, like someone wants like official video, official evidence, something like that. And they're like, no, 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 like uh, stop watching. Stop looking at me. Stop asking me like something like that. They're being pressured. Wow, okay. Yeah. All right, let's pull the next two weeks. Libra and this person. I'm hearing vice, okay? Something about a vice. Maybe someone has a vice, or this is about a VP. All right. VP. Libra and this person. I'm, Libra and this person, please. Ace of Swords, the truth speaks for itself. In the next two weeks, yeah, Cancer energy. Yeah, yeah, Three of Swords. For your grievances, okay? What else is here? Just a second. Yeah, Magician. So, Libra. It does look like you have a new opportunity here, okay? This person's going to be extending themselves to you. They want something to happen, okay? It's like, let's talk or let's connect. I'm getting specifically the word connect, okay? Um, and I don't feel like you're interested from what it looks. Of course, you can choose whatever you want. The thing is, it's like you're going silent, you're going AWOL, all right? Because you have a choice at hand now. You have some new opportunity opening up to you. This person is still trying to be in your business, but I'm seeing that someone's looking into whatever information this is and you're just laying low, all right? You're laying low. Show me Libra in the next two weeks. Okay, I'm hearing that someone's suddenly gonna show up, all right? 
So maybe you have like an unexpected visitor is what I'm getting here. Knight of Cups. Yeah, the thing is, uh, you feel like someone, first of all, they owe you, whether this is money or an apology or something to change here, because you feel like you're on the receiving end of something that's not true. Okay. It's not true. The truth speaks for itself, or that was an injustice and now I'm owed. Okay. And that's what's coming in here. So there you are too, your justice energy coming out strong here. Wow. Yep. Your intuition. Okay. Listen to it. Something about your intuition is super important. You have two cards indicating this here. You need to kind of quiet down, not allow anything or anyone to affect you or stir you, especially spiritually, emotionally, things like this, because in this quiet moment or in this quiet energy, you're going to have that clarity and you're going to feel happy. So like nothing's going to get to you in the next two weeks. Even if at first you might feel bad or you feel sad, you're going to find happiness throughout this. I do feel like there will be a choice that you are able to make. It depends on what you want to do here, of course, okay? But you will be doing a lot of reflecting. And I also feel like you're just disappearing, okay? You're like you're disappearing from this person's world, from this person's view, from their sight. Like you don't want them to see you anymore. You could be like maybe blocking someone or you're going, you're going AWOL. Like you're just, you're going out like in the wilderness or away from where these people or this person can bother you. And you're actually gonna be really happy like that, at least for this time period. I love you so very much, Libra. Feel free to check previous and future reads for more or different information. Friends, family members, neighbors, coworkers, beep and tom, beep and tiny, no, straight to the place and see so we know what everybody in the world is up to. Kisses. Love you. Bye.